Well, NOAA is warning that we could see more hurricanes this season than ever before. Chief Meteorologist Eric Fisher joins us now. And Eric, NOAA used the word extraordinary to describe this upcoming season. It's really, really interesting. We've been watching how this has been setting up over the last few months and kind of looking at the main indicators for what creates the hurricane season in the Atlantic. And they've issued this outlook that does call for the most named storms that they have ever called for. And those outlooks go back a little over 20 years. So we're not talking 100 years, but in recent memory, this is a really bold forecast. They're calling for 17 to 25 named storms, 8 to 13 of them to become hurricanes and four to seven of them to become major hurricanes. Last year was very busy as well in the Atlantic. The main factors here, we have La Nina coming on in the Pacific, which means we've got a little stripe of cooler than average water developing, and that decreases wind shear. So wind shear is something that hurricanes don't like. Basically, you get like a subtropical jet stream that blows across the tropics, disrupts hurricanes, but that's not expected this year. Then we look out into the Atlantic, and this has been setting all sorts of records. Basically, the tropical Atlantic has been setting a new warmest on record every day since last March. And right now, the water temperature is typical of mid-August. And in the Caribbean, this is actually the biggest standout zone. The average weekly temperature of the water here is warmer than any other year on record for any day before the month of September. And we're sitting here in May. So really extraordinary water. Now, some things still have to come together, right? You have to have the seedlings for all of this, which are waves that come off the coast of Africa. If it's a quiet monsoon season, then there might be fewer of those. If there's a lot of dust coming off of Africa, that can suppress activity. So things still have to happen, even if the water's really warm and the whole pattern is very typical for a hyperactive season. But these are the names on the list. It starts with Alberto. William is the last one. And after that, there is a secondary list if we need it. This might be one of those seasons. Paula? All right. Eric, thanks so much.